What's up, everyone? Now, Marty, I tried to warn you to stay away from me, man. I tried to warn you to leave me alone. For you and then we're going William to leave me alone. I warned you. But now look what happened. You made me drag in YouTube. You made me drag in law enforcement. And I didn't want to go that route. I did not want to go that route, dude. All I have ever asked of you is that you and William and N-Word Boy leave me alone and let me do my job as a streamer, as a content creator. And yeah, I've said and done some shit that I'm not proud of. I'll admit that. I've, I've definitely said a lot of shit that was out of line. I definitely have. But I tried to warn you, Nick, to leave me alone. Many times I warned you. I sat right there many times and told you to leave me the fuck alone. And for you and N-Word Boy and William to leave me alone. I've told you guys this. But now you guys have to face the consequences of your actions. Yeah, law enforcement got involved. YouTube's gotten involved. I told you, Marty, all you had to do was leave me alone, dude. You think I wanted to go this route? You think I wanted to go this route? All I ever asked of you and William and Edward Boy was to leave me alone. That's all I ever asked is that you leave me alone, Marty. But now because of your actions and the shit you've done to me over the years, I had to get law enforcement and YouTube staff members involved as a result of your actions. I told you, Marty, to leave me alone. I fucking warned you. To all you guys in chat, even the ones that don't like me, how many times have I sat there and warned the Music Biz Marty to leave me alone? How many times have I sat there and told him to leave me alone? Well, now something has happened. Now, because of Marty's actions and what he's done to me, something has officially happened. YouTube's gotten involved and law enforcement has gotten involved and they are now working to take him down. I actually received an email from YouTube 
this morning. And you guys might not believe me now, but you just wait. Y'all sitting there talking shit now, but just wait. Watch what happens. Watch what the fuck happens. Yo, New York, what up, man? How you doing, New York Empire? How you doing, brother? But yo, New York Empire, I know you've seen enough of the videos to know what's up, man. How many times have I sat there and told Marty to leave me alone? How many times have I sat there and warned him to back off and to let me be? Along with William and Edward Boy. Like, how many times have I told all of them to back off and leave me alone? Like I said, Marty, I understand that you're obsessed with me. I get it. You have this weird obsession with me. But when I turned you down, you should have let it go and walked away. I warned you, dog. I told you to leave me alone. I fucking warned you to leave me be. But you didn't want to do that, did you? For Marty, yes. For me, not so much. Though, like I said, Marty, I fucking warned you, dude. I warned you. Matter of fact, Saren, your ex-girlfriend, even warned you, man. Even Saren fucking warned you, bro. Saren sat there and fucking warned you, dog. More times than even I did. But you still didn't listen, did you? You just had to keep running your mouth, didn't you? You had to keep pushing it. And now as a result, look what happened. Now you done fucked up, you done got, you done forced my hand to get YouTube and the police involved. Now what? Now what, tough guy? All I ever asked is that you leave me the fuck alone. That's all I've ever asked of you. Is for you and William and N-Word Boy to leave me alone. That's all I've ever asked of you, man. Do you think I wanted to go this route? 
No, I didn't want to go this fucking route, dude. And no, I'm not going to read the email. I'm going to let you guys find out the hard way. When Marty goes to jail for the shit he's done to me, or when him and N-Word Boy and William get shut down, that's when I'll read the email. Because I want you guys to find out the fucking hard way. And you don't think I don't know you guys are just trying to get me to... Bruh, I know what y'all are doing. Y'all are trying to get me to read it. So that y'all can help Marty out. That's what you're trying to do. I know what you're trying to do. I'm not stupid. Y'all are trying to call me a liar and say it, say that so you can read the email and plan out shit. Marty knows that it's real. Don't blame me. Ask him. If you don't believe me, ask him your damn self. He'll tell you. He'll tell you himself. Go over to his channel and ask him yourself if you don't believe me. But like I said to Marty, I tried to warn you, dude. I tried to tell you to leave me the fuck alone. For years, I have told you to leave me the fuck alone, dude. But you didn't want to listen, did you? You didn't want to listen. Now you have to find out the hard way. And I didn't want it to go that route. I didn't. I would have just rather you guys left me alone. Marty and William and N-Word Boy. I would have rather y'all just left me alone. Let me do my thing. But... You made your bed. Now you got to lie in it, man. That's all I'm going to say, man. Is you made your bed, Marty. Now you have to lie in that bed. You made your bed. Now you got to sleep in it, dude. I've warned you many times to leave me alone. Now, Marty, you can still put a stop to all this. You and N-Word Boy and William can all put a stop to this if you just leave me alone. If you and Edward Boy and William delete your channels now, you guys can walk away scot free right now. And I can look the other way. Because right now, Nick, the ball's in my court, dude.
Right now, the ball is in my court. But like I said, you can still get out of this. You can. If you and Edward Blaine William delete your channels and leave me alone and stop harassing me and my friends and family and stop going after me, then I'll back off. I'll back off when you back off, Marty. I told you I wasn't joking around, dude. Now, dude, now look what your actions have caused you, man. All you had to do was leave me alone. That's all you had to do, man. But you didn't, you couldn't do it, could you? Now, because of you, YouTube and law enforcement has now gotten involved. And that's on you, man. Like I said, Marty, you can make all this disappear. All you got to do is one thing. All you and William and Edward Boy have to do is one thing. Back off, leave me alone, and never come after me again, no matter what I'm doing. Whether I'm on Twitch, kick, on here, you leave me alone, I leave you alone. You understand how it works? You leave me alone, I'll leave you alone. That's how this works. You stop bullying me and let me do my job, and we'll be good. That's all I've ever asked, is that you leave me the fuck alone. That's all I've ever asked, is that you leave me alone. For you and William and Edward Boyd to leave me alone is all I've ever asked of you. Is that really that much to ask for? Because I don't think it is. I told you and I warned you several times to back off. I told you, Marty. I sat there and warned you for years that eventually all of this would come back to bite you in the ass. Now look what happened. I told you to back off, dude. Now your actions have caused your own demise. Your actions have caused your own downfall, Nick. I tried to tell you. I tried to warn you, dude. Like I said, if you don't believe me, go read Marty's um, go read Marty's Discord servers, man. Like seriously, go read Marty's Discord servers. Go read his community posts. You'll see exactly what I'm talking about. Don't believe me? Go read his shit. Y'all are in his Discord servers. I know y'all are in there. Go read the fucking shit. Go read what he posts. It's all right there, dude.
I don't know which server it's in. You'd have to ask around. Because he does have several servers. Like, he actually does have several servers. But, like I said, Marty wants to fuck around. Or he wanted to fuck around. Now he's going to find out. I've warned him several times to leave me alone, people. I've warned him, N-Word Boy, and William all to leave me alone many a times. But he didn't want to listen. Now he has to pay for his crimes. Yo, Wade, what up, man? How you doing, dude? Sorry I didn't see your, uh, your comment, bro. How you doing, Wade? What's up, man? Well, like I said, Marty... This is your final warning before shit gets very, 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 very ugly very quick with YouTube. We can do this the easy way, or we can do this shit the hard way. You can either leave me alone and tell William and, and N-Word Boy to leave me alone as well. Or I'll be taking every bit of evidence I have against you and sending it to the YouTube staff. You understand how that works? You either leave me alone or the evidence is getting shipped out to the YouTube staff tonight. And from there, I can't. It's out of my hands what they do. It's out of my hands what they do if I send them that evidence. I have no control over what they would do. I tried to warn you, man. So, Marty, take your pick. Are you and William and Edward Boy going to leave me alone and let me do my job on Twitch and on Kick and on here? Are you guys going to leave me alone and let me do my shit? Or do I have to send all the evidence that I have against you to YouTube and let them deal with you? Because I've already got the green light to send the evidence as soon as I have it all. I have the green light to send out any information to them that I have. So what's it going to be, Marty? Take your fucking pick. Either you you and N-Word Boy and William leave me alone. Or I send all the evidence to them in an email. And you're going to have a whole lot of motherfuckers at your door. I hell, you've already had FBI at your doorstep once already. You've already had feds at your door once already, man.
do you really want to have them at your door again? Because I don't think you do. Because this time, they won't be there to give you a warning. This time, they will be there to arrest you. Yeah, ask his ex-girlfriend, Saren. She'll tell you. He had FBI show up at his doorstep because he fucked with Foodie Beauty. And she called the FBI on him. He even made a video about it. And well, that. But, like I said to you, Marty, this is your final fucking warning. Period. I tried to be nice. But now you forced my hand. Which is why I'm giving you one final warning. One last warning to leave me alone before shit goes down. I warned you, dog. I told you shit was going to go down. I told you if, if you did not leave me alone that I was going to legally take action against you. But if this is the way you really want it, we can go down that road, Nick. We can. We can go down that road if you want to. I'd rather spare your life. I'd rather spare your life for your parents' sake, dude. Because I wouldn't want your parents to see you sitting behind bars like that, man. I'd rather spare your life, but if you and William and Edward boy don't want to be spared, then I have no choice but to put you on the chopping block if that's the road that you want to go down. But as I said, I'm giving you until tomorrow morning. I'm giving you until tomorrow morning for you and we're going and William to leave me alone for good. Delete your accounts, get off of YouTube, and leave me alone. Otherwise, by 8.30 tomorrow morning, I will be sending in all the evidence that I've compiled against you that makes you look like shit. And from there, YouTube will be taking over. And you will probably be getting a knock at your front door soon after that. Within the next few days. So, take your pick, Marty. You have 24 hours. You have 24 hours to make your choice. If you don't leave me alone, well, like I said, I'm going to be sending that evidence out to... I'm going to be sending that evidence out to fucking YouTube and their staff. Like I said, I'm trying to be nice. Even though you don't deserve it. Even though you don't deserve me being nice to you. You do not deserve my kindness. After everything you've done to me. So like I said Marty. You have 24 hours to make your choice. You and William and Edward boy have 24 hours. To make your fucking choice. Either leave me alone,
or I'm sending that evidence out first thing in the morning. It's your call, Nick. Either leave me alone. Or I'm just going to gather more evidence, send it to YouTube at 8.30 tomorrow morning, and from there it'll be out of my hands. I mean, I'm already gathering up some pretty damning evidence already. I've already got a crap ton of damning evidence as is. Oh, I got screenshots. I got videos. I got all kinds of shit. And he knows it. So like I said, Marty, take your pick. You have until... You have until 8.30 tomorrow morning when I send that evidence out to make your choice. I'm giving you until tomorrow morning, 8.30 a.m. to make your choice. So if I was you, I think wisely. You and William and N-Word Boy have 24 hours to leave me alone. Otherwise, it's out of my hands. I can't control what YouTube's going to do once they get their hands on the evidence, dude. It's your choice.